So at least she's sleeping. That's something, I suppose. It's going to take more than a few weeks for her to accept what happened and even longer for her to be able to talk about it. Yeah, I know, love. I, I just expected her to lean on me and April a bit more, you know, but she's hardly talking to us at all. And I know Natalie's tried to get hold of her. Hi. Hi. I'm, I'll get started on breakfast. Did you my message? Yeah, I did. I'm sorry. My life's complicated. I've got BJ to think about. And I freaked you out the gifts, right? A little. Yeah. Well, that might have been the problem. I'm an idiot. No, 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 you're not a, no, it was very sweet. Can I explain? You don't need to do that. No, please, I want to. It's just that I knew that I'd be in meetings all day yesterday and I felt bad about the fact that I wasn't going to be able to call you. So, being a complete genius and also totally cool, I lined up a few things on the net before I went to work. And in retrospect, I might have got a little overexcited. And it's because I don't, I don't do this kind of thing often. So, I'm, I'm really sorry that I overstepped the mark. You know what, it was kind of flattering. Does that mean you'll reconsider the knockback on dinner? I'm just gonna cook for you. Sucker. And now you're trying to impress. Moussaka's like my favourite dish. No way. A Greek girl that loves moussaka. Who would have thought? <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> um, oh, I, I don't know, Jamie. Look, Leah, I'll make it easy for you. Lunch instead of dinner. It's less formal and that way you can bring BJ too if you want. Just think about it and get back to me. I'll think about it and get back to you. But how about I, I, I shake your coffee on the house? Yes, please. Thank you. Only if it's takeaway, though. I've got some things to do.